Insomniac is wrapping up Spider-Man 2. There, of course, will be follow-up patches to fix performance and more than likely a few DLCs, but a majority of the team that worked on the game has allegedly moved on to the Wolverine game, so we got a potential update on the release date as well. We are already a few years removed from the announcement of the Wolverine video game, and we've had nothing, and obviously it makes sense. Insomniac is one of the hardest working developers out there, constantly putting out brand new games every two to three years that are obviously charting pretty high when it comes to sales and scores. But what was going on with Wolverine? Well, according to reports, they wanted the best of the best to work on it. So there was already a team that was working on Wolverine, but they were also waiting to wrap up majority of the work on Marvel Spider-Man 2 before they leave a smaller crew to work on some of the DLC patches and additional content, while a bulk of this brand new team that they established with Spider-Man 2 would now be transitioning over to work on Wolverine. Now, this means that the project is obviously still quite the ways off. And by all accounts from what we're hearing, it's going to be about two to two and a half years, giving us a approximate release date of holiday 2025. Now, in my opinion, this seems pretty likely. I know a lot of people were thinking they're going to drop it in 2024. Honestly, they still could, but... I feel like that's a little too soon, especially that Insomniac is going to want to make sure that this game is uh, very much polished and up to standards and doesn't underdeliver. They always tend to put out games that feel complete, which a lot of studios out there don't. And Insomniac is one of the best in the industry on having to delay something if they need more time and Sony allows them to. So... Even though people are saying next year, I personally don't believe it. I just don't think Insomniac wants to put that much pressure on all their employees. And we've heard about how they got one of the best cultures in terms of game development and the people working there in gaming. So, again, I think they're going to take their time. And look, 2025, it's two years away. Like, that's not that far away. Meaning next year, we could already be looking at a big reveal. You know, an actual gameplay reveal and a story trailer and everything. And then slow trickle into 2025. So in my opinion, this is all fine. And um, I'll be glad to see whatever they have to offer. Especially that Spider-Man is going to keep us going for a while. And if the rumors are true, there could be a game in between them. I mean, maybe another Ratchet and Clank. Maybe smaller DLC. Uh, who knows? Um, maybe an expansion or pseudo expansion like Miles Morales. I mean, Insomniac doesn't seem to really... Uh, conform to normal game development, so we'll see what happens. <laughs>